Hey guys, welcome back to my Pokemon Diamond Nuzlocke. And I'm back at the Lost Tower. So I was just continuing my journey. So I picked up a TM27 return, which is great for a normal Pokemon to use, like my Anna or Hope. So, um, the reason why I'm actually here is to get the HM for strength, which is all the way at the top. So that's what I need to do. And there, I haven't uh, battled this couple yet, so I'm going to go ahead and do that. I can't embarrass myself again, not in front of my girlfriend. I don't want to look bad again, not when my boyfriend is watching. So this couple wants to show off, and they don't want to uh, seem embarrassing to one another. So here's the young couple, Mike and Nat, as they send out their Murkrow and Mischievous, which is a ghost type and a dark and flying type. So this should be an interesting battle. So um, my fresh has Rock Tomb, so I can use that. Well, actually, I want uh, Super Jai to use uh, Spark on um, Murkrow, so I'm going to go and attack Mischievous instead. So, Spark on Murkrow. So, Fresh Aqua Jet. It didn't do too much to Mischievous. And the Spark from Super Jai nailed that Murkrow. And Murkrow goes down in one hit, which was nice. So now uh, my team can team up on Mischievous. So Mischievous used the mean luck, and its effect is that I can't switch out any of my Pokemon until this battle is over. So I'm going for another Aqua Jet. And I'll go for a Spark. So yeah, it's time for Super Jai to finish off this mischievous. So I've beaten the young couple. Oh jeez, man, that's a downer. This makes me feel hollow inside. Oh so hollow. Okay, it's time to go upstairs. Look, I've made it to the top already. And Repel's effect wore off. The Lost Tower is where the spirits of departed Pokemon are put to rest. Those that enjoyed long lives, those whose times were short, all the departed Pokemon shall find solace here. It is good of you to have visited. Here, take this hidden machine. So this is HM4, which was Strength. Well, I actually need the next gym badge to use, I think. To use that hidden move, Strength, I've forgotten where exactly, but you must visit a Pokemon gym. So I think when I beat the Veilstone City gym, I'll be able to use it outside of battle. Let me make your journey out of this place less frightening. Take this. Obtain the Cleanse Tag, which is a held item that um, my first Pokemon could use. So I'll let them explain it for you. The cleanse tag. Let the first Pokemon in your team hold it. It will help wild Pokemon away so you can leave unhindered. Is that what he said? So you can leave unhindered. There we go. So it's time for me to leave this place. And I don't think I have any escape ropes, so I have to go all the way back down. He's not now, Zubat. I don't want to battle you. But if I must, since Fresh is almost leveled up anyways, I, I'll take you out with the Rock Tomb. So Rock Tomb's secondary effect, it lowers speed. Aw, oh, Zubat has Confuse Ray, that's a bummer. 
Hopefully Fresh can still attack. I'll use Aqua Jet. Please attack. Yes, that's right, Fresh. Alright, Zubat's been beaten. So it'll take one more battle for Fresh to level up. Okay, let's go all the way down and let's uh, head to Solacian Town. Okay, I see the next set of stairs. We're only a few floors away. So here's another wild encounter. And finally I see a Ghastly. After all this time of seeing only Zubats. So Ghastly is here. I'm gonna start off with an Aqua Jet. And that did half to Ghastly. So Ghastly uses the Nightshade, which deals damage equal to Ghastly's level, which is 20. So here comes another Aqua Jet. And I'm surprised that I didn't take it out. And here comes another Nightshade that's going to strike fresh. I'm not worried because one last Aqua Jet will finish off the Ghastly. So Ghastly's been taken out, and Fresh finally grows to level 24. Great. So now what should I put in the front? Um, let's put Hope back in the front. And I'll use uh, Repels the rest of the way down. There we go. So no more wild encounters in for the rest of my time here as I try to exit. Run, 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 MGS. Okay, I think, yeah, this is the second floor, so one more floor down and I'm out of here. Okay, uh, see you later, Lost Tower. Back at Route 209. And if I run a little bit further ahead, I'll be in Solacion Town. As you can see with that sign over there. So, uh, Repel wore off, which doesn't matter. I'm not in any wild grass or anything anymore. So let's check out this house. Pro Pokemon Catcher Wanted. I think this is the house where you show them a certain Pokemon and they, they'll give you a reward. So, oh, welcome. You saw the notice outside about us hiring, right? Is that a Pokedex there? Then you must know Professor Rowan. You're just the Pokemon searching expert we've been looking for. Combi, I want you to bring me one. You must bring it today or we're not going to be able to run our main article. Remember, it has to be today before the date rolls over. Um, my um, Pokemon catching will be limited thanks to th this being a Nuzlocke, so I don't know if I could help you all that much with getting a Combi. So I'll talk to this guy. Breathing in the refreshing air, it even perks up Pokemon, that's why I'm out here. Since I'm right in front of the Pokemon Center, I'm going to heal my Pokemon. I'll be right back outside. I'm back, and my Pokemon are as good as new. So let's check out Salacion Town for a little bit. Your encounters with Pokemon can be considered your shared history. This here is a Poketch app called Pokemon History. Use it to see your history of Pokemon catches. So, alright, I, I gained a new app, which is the Pokemon History app. Pokemon History app shows the most recently obtained Pokemon. It's a pretty nifty feature. I'm too little so I don't know how to battle very good. 
The nice daycare lady is raising my Pokemon for me. Oh, that's very nice of her to do. Every Sunday I visit the Lost Tower. So a bunch of cowgirls and cowboys here. Howdy, traveler. There's no gym in this town. You'll be wanting Veilstone or Pastoria. So thanks for that news flash. I already knew that. There used to be nothing here but a road that went straight through. Over time, Pokemon and people just gathered and the town came to be. Okay, I'm gonna check out this house. There's an old lady. Every so often, an egg will be found at the Pokemon daycare and they're found without anyone knowing how they got there. Is someone leaving them there? They say no one has ever seen a Pokemon actually lay an egg. So it hasn't been proven that Pokemon actually lay eggs. Hmm, I haven't really thought about that before. But I'm sure they actually do lay eggs. Alright, so I'm going to take a look at what's back here in this corner. Looks like another house up here. A bunch of ledges. So I guess I have to hop down. You just have to keep hopping down a different direction. So I'll go to a certain house. So it looks like I reached this house first. And let's see what's inside. What this woman has to say. You can customize Pokeballs by affixing seals on them. Oh, you don't have a seal case? Well, here you go. Alright, so I obtained a seal case. Another um, person who likes to give stuff away. Very nice. First check the um, heading ball capsules in your PC menu. Next choose a capsule and apply seals to it as you wish. When you're done put the capsule on a Pokeball. So that's for those of you who, who like to customize your Pokeballs. So I'm not very into um, customizing and using seals so I'm not gonna do that. So I'm gonna go back around so that I could visit that other house that I wasn't able to go to. And to do that I need to hop on those other ledges. I wonder if this is the daycare man. Oh it is. I'm the daycare man. We look after the precious Pokemon of other trainers. Okay, have a word with your wife. Got it. I'll keep that in mind. But I personally like to raise my own Pokemon, so no thanks. Okay, so here's another house. I wonder if I'll get anything else. Your Pokemon has a brave nature. Did you know that a Pokemon's nature determines how it will grow? This area had many Pokemon from the olden days. They say there were big Pokemon ranches around these parts. Hmm. This place um, has a southern feel to it. As you can tell from everyone who talks, it around these parts. This uh, cowboy cowgirl language. Okay, so there's nothing left to see in this town, I believe. So, um, well actually I was trying to get on my bike. So I'm finally on my bike. Okay, so I'm getting out of this town. So here's Route 210. There's a, ber a berry patch there, I'll pick that up later. And there's a trainer battle up ahead. So I'll actually save this route for next time. So thank you all for watching my Pokemon Diamond Nuzlocke. Comment like sub and in the next part I'll go through this new route and battle some more trainers. I'll see you guys later.